a loyal employee is framed for embezzlement, then murdered by his employers, only to be reborn as their youngest son, with a yearn for revenge guiding his hostile takeover. In fact, the second uncle had long suspected Dao Jun and sent people to secretly track him. He found that Hyeno and Dao Jun was often in contact. He brought these photos to Grandpa, who also became suspicious and asked if Dao Jun had gone to the United States last time. And Hyeno was also an investor from the United States. It is absolutely no coincidence that two times of chance are together. At the same time, Hyeno had not completed the acquisition, and D Young Group, which was originally in financial difficulties, suddenly had money and proposed to continue the acquisition. Due to the competition among the three parties, the price of Hondu Steel has risen to 700 billion. Elder Uncle was also very strange. Why D Young suddenly have so much money, and the trusted followers quickly brought back some information. Elder Uncle did not expect that he was the driving force behind this matter. The next day, Grandpa insisted on sending Dao Jun to school. He deliberately tested Dao Jun in the car to see if the 24 billion had been changed into dollars and then went to the United States. And Dao Jun said it was true, he and his father invested in a Hollywood movie in the LA. Grandpa looked very unhappy because he thought that investing in movies was just a small business. The next day, Dao Jun and Uncle Hyeno continued to discuss the purchase in the hotel, but they received a free flower basket from the hotel. It happened that Min Young, who works part-time here, came to deliver the flower basket. Min Young thinks that Tao Jun is coming to play, and she laughs. You are indeed a playboy, but after seeing Hyeno, she knows they are discussing business. Min Young leaves the room embarrassed. Dao Jun and Hyeno continue to discuss the plan, but they did not know that the flower basket had been installed with a bug. Their conversations were all recorded, and then they were sent to Grandpa's table. Hearing their conversations, Grandpa realized that the owner of this chess game was actually his grandson. You're a 